Take it way back to 1883, seven years before the birth of Gatsby. The South was racist, but the slaves were free. Not really. Atticus Finch, what a man was he? His wife is dead, and now instead, he's got a couple kidding, Scout and Jem. The Depression hasn't started, they still got bread, but Americans soon would be in the red. You know, Germany was typically pretty cool, but now their new leader didn't like the Jews. Oops. Scout did not think this followed the golden rule. Hitler couldn't hide the fact that Gatsby died in a pool. So now summer came around, and here comes still. All the way from Mississippi, the giant landfill. Curious about the Radley, but it gave him the chills. Was he crazy, or was he just from Dansville? Arthur was his name, he always stayed inside. Many rumors spread, maybe he died. His house was creepy, but the children tried to meet him, or see him, or confirm that he died. Then something strange that Scout Dunn found two chewing gums hanging around in the Radley's tree, hole nice and round. However, Atticus was not too proud. Stop tormenting that man. Let him mind his business. The children had to follow their father's infinite wisdom. But Jim just had to go with Scout and deal as witness. Unfortunately, Nathan got a little bit suspicious. On the run through the fence, Jim caught his pants. They tore. He had to leave them if he wanted a chance. Jim had to get them back. Yeah, he was bold then. That night he went back for them, but they were fixed and folded. Now Tom Robinson is accused of rape, and everybody knows he's gonna lose because of his race. Lawyer Atticus still undertook the case. Told himself he was courageous for goodness sake. Miss Money's house is burning, going down to the ground And winning the times of flurry, all the frowns all about The lesson that they are learning, you know, Scout Acting out the things that Gemma swore, a town that needs her clown Because Scout was getting cold, surrounded by the snow But then she laid a note, his blanket on his shoulders Wrapped around her bones, but who she didn't know It was magic, well, no, it was the man they called Boo But forget about all that, we'll move on to Uncle Tommy's been jailed without a bail, but that town without a bomb His hope to live his hill, but now they got him to become Trapped the bomb, he dropped his line, Vietnam, here comes the mob Addicts protect the town from anyone who wishes my arm From with my words, I'll my automatic fire I'm when Walter comes with trouble with the people up in Ultra Room But them is OG Jean Louis when running in the angry swarm. What is all the chaos, sir? Why are they all standing here? Mr. Cunningham, I know you're saying to worry. He's a dear. She didn't know the story or the impact of her standing there, but with her innocence, she made a group of racists disappear. I'll tell Walter you said, hey, let's clear out of here. Cold, the trial's getting started now, the children found the way to town The father's just a story down, making Bob look like a clown The kids head out to look around and find the ray deserves a crown It looks just like a ghost on it, so just lay it down I've got nothing but pity for you, witness for the state But that is not extended, putting this man's life at stake So men are born stronger, some ladies make better cake But in court, should be equal, despite color, creed, or race Guilty, guilty, guilty <laughs> So, Tom's going to jail for the rest of his life Wonder what'll happen to his poor wife Maybe she'll be stalked by a man with a knife At least she wasn't shot with 17 bullets True. It was Halloween night, such a fateful day Bob went after Jim and Scout for payback anyway During the scuffle, Ewell managed to pass away All because Bradley came out to save the day Harming something harmless would just be quite absurd It wasn't till the end of the book that it occurred This lesson Scout and Jem had already concurred That it was a sin to kill a mocking bird Stay safe, and I'll see you, I hope, soon.